This Saturday, the Crystal Ballroom in Somerville will host a rock concert that aims to do much more than just entertain. In tonight's Five for Good, the local cancer survivor drumming up support for equity when it comes to access to care. Stephen Moore has loved music his whole life. Started drumming at 12. Uh, I've been bothering people ever since. Precise, always goal oriented. It takes a lot to make him miss a beat, but a routine colonoscopy at age 50 did just that. I woke up from my colonoscopy in a room filled with five other people. And I said, wow, uh, I guess we have something to talk about. It was stage three cancer, a tumor the size of a golf ball. Something that hits you very hard, especially the parent and husband and friend. And but instead of fear taking people. over, Stephen was uh, overwhelmed by his honest, relative I, I good fortune. Easy. He had great doctors, an understanding workplace, loving family and friends. You know, sitting in a room by yourself uh, in an infusion chair, you have a lot of time to think about it, a whole lot of things. Incredibly expensive, it's incredibly arduous. It's who's there to help people who doesn't have that level of support. Oncologist Dr. Christopher Lathan is one such helper. He runs the Cancer Care Equity Program at Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. Cancer in many communities is like this quiet word. You don't really talk about it. I realized there was an opportunity to educate and impact the community in a positive way. Dr. Lathan says while improvements have been made, black men in Boston have higher rates of cancer and death from cancer than white men. Black women have higher rates of death from cancer than white women. There are also inequities in Asian and Hispanic populations. It, it's multifactorial, trying to get people to get to their screenings or if they even have a PCP. But the other part of it is the, you know, the demands and control on your time. And what if you have a job where you work second shift and you can't take a day off? His program at Dana-Farber conducts research but also goes into underserved communities to help people navigate and get the care they need. Stephen learned about that work and decided to make some noise about it, bringing on his friend and fellow drummer Chris Antonowicz to organize a fundraising concert, Let's Rock Cancer, at Crystal Ballroom in Davis Square. You're going to get Latin rock, you're going to get punk, you're going to get mod. Stephen is the drummer for Uncivil Servants, a band led by former Somerville mayor Joe Curtitoni. Chris yeah. is a producer, yeah. record store like owner, you. and member of the band Muzzins. We got Muck in the Myers, we got Vapors of Morphine, we got the Chelsea Curve, Muzzins, Ray Liriano experience, and Uncivil Servants. So we're ready to rock and rock for a good cause. For Stephen, it will be a meaningful celebration that he's doing well. He wants more people to have that same outcome. To have an event where people can let go and, and shout if they want. I and mean, it's the whole hope of a rock show is that people can just let go. Yeah, he hopes people enjoy and support this important work. So Let's Rock Cancer is this Saturday night, along with all of those incredible bands you heard about. Dr. Lathan will be there to speak about his work. You can find information about how to attend on WCVB.com.